The Ride of the Legends 2017 is a journey from Wellington to Auckland between the second and third tests of the British and Irish Lions Tour. Raising money for conductive education, the event joins two incredible sports together. And to tell us more and how we can get involved, please welcome to the cafe, Buck Shelford and Ian Jones. Oh, welcome. yes! <laughs> So, nice so you're going to be cycling from Wellington to Auckland and you're going to start the day after the second test. Really, mm. guys? 8am the, well, the day after the, the second test. test so. You might as well get on the road early, eh? even with a sore head. Well, I guess <laughs> Good way so. to clear it out, I yeah. guess. <laughs> OK, so why did you want to get involved with this, Buck? Well, this is a, an idea from uh, the British. So mm. Peter Winterbottom has been in charge of this. He's... Uh, He's uh, the man who's actually had it in Australia, had it in South Africa eight years ago, things like that, and they've decided to bring it here as well and get New Zealanders excited about it. And um, it's brilliant. I think it's a great idea, a great way of uh, raising awareness. And uh, it's right in between the, the two tests, and it's going to be... It's going to be a big day on Saturday. So you reckon it will sure. take you a week or so, under Well, it's going to take us five nights, but we're going to stop along the way. Like yeah. the first one, Wellington to Marston. We've got a great night planned in Marston, so a lot of the locals are going to come down. Buck and guys will be there on the barbecue, just sharing some stories from the day. And each and every one of those days, and a wonderful golf day in Taupo, finishing oh, up, of course, like a walk in the park. when we get to Auckland, having a wonderful charity night. But it's a conductive education, which is we're really trying to just promote that charity and just be part of that. And because... We're part of that. Wayne Smith, the All Black coach, is patron of conductive education. We're such a passionate man, the professor, and so that's why we're all on board with it too. And conductive education, tell us a little bit more about what that actually is. Well, it's, more, it's about uh, young children that, that have got uh, memory problems, and it's about re-educating them, uh, just little things like that. But also for uh, people with cerebral palsy who are, you know, that that actually they keep continually mm. changing all the time as they grow older. So they've got to learn to adapt to that as well. And it's, uh, this is the education process of helping these young kids along. It's a fundraising ride for conductive education. It's a fun ride as well, but it's also an awareness ride. There's a lot of bit about charities and about fundraising. It's a huge element of any sort of charity, but it's also the awareness. And so hopefully people can come down where we are, you know, Palmerston North. Well, no, and that's um, a good thing, because there Taupo, are... Taupo, yeah. Thames, come down and have a chat. We yeah. can talk about it, but also share the banter. Yeah, yeah. No, it'd be good for, the, um, you know, I guess fans to get up close and personal with some of the legends of rugby. But how, how long have you ever spent on a bike before, Ian? Oh, <laughs> yeah, listen, I've bad. done, I've done lots, you know, either Iron Man or God's Own. We've spent sort of six, eight hours on a bike, that type of thing. But we'll be riding 120, 30k, I guess, a day. We'll be stopping a bit along the way, so hopefully there'll be little cafes getting ready for us. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, okay, yeah, cafes that can stop. And Just before we started, bang. it was going, like, yeah, I'm quite fit. But Buck, though, Buck's been doing a bit of training <laughs> for it, haven't you? By the, time that, by the time I get back from this ride, I'm going to have calluses on my backside. Yes. <laughs> at the moment, they're going to they're blisters at the moment. I'll be ready for the next America's no, Cup. This, 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 this guy is pretty tough on a bike. This guy's pretty tough oh, out there. And we'll just, on, he'll be we? up there. And so we'll Do you be... wear Lycra? Of course uh, we wear I Lycra. I love Lycra. <laughs> What's wrong with Lycra? I never thought I'd hear that coming from Ian Jones. Yeah. I love Lycra. No, I love Lycra. It's comfy. It's, you know, it it's comfy. aerodynamic. Yeah. We're all about the sort of aero and bucks a good wind block as oh, well. I've <laughs> got to be aerodynamic. I'm such a big guy. I'm trying to get thinner. Yeah, nice. No, no you'll look the part. This is a great way to raise awareness, as you said. Eight also all Blacks, money. five yeah. lines. Yeah, yes. brilliant. Four lines. Yeah, and, and 40 other people as well. So you can always hop along. Yeah, if you see us out in the, out the road, Others can come along and join us for, the, for a day or a couple of days and Brilliant. just share the fun. All right, I wanted to talk rugby and quickly ask you how we'll go on Saturday night, but we've run out of time. I'm sure we know the answer to that. <laughs> um, thanks so much for coming on the cafe. The very best of luck for all the fundraising, boys. Best of luck to Thank you for the much. backsides. Uh, for more details on how you can help, go to the website rideofthelegendsnz.co.nz and you can follow the lads on Facebook and Twitter. Oh, it's so fantastic to see those legends and what a great cause as well.